Looks like Piper has found her spot. <laughs> yeah, she's been all over in here while we're driving. Yeah, she's up on the bed. This is our maiden voyage. The guy is still right here, as predicted. We're gonna wave this bohemoth and see what uh, poundage we get. Yeah, I got the um, Way My Truck app, it's a Cascale app. So we don't even have to go inside. Perfect. So yeah, just got a full tank of diesel, full tank of death, full tank of water, and everything on board. Firewood, two dogs, two people, food. Right, I'm just putting in company name and everything, except fee is twelve dollars, except please wait. What's your guess? <laughs> I have no idea. I mean I know it's heavy. Processing payment. Oh, we're 26,260 pounds gross. Let me pull off the scale and we'll see how this breaks down. That's, that's awesome. Yeah, that was really, oh, really it just, convenient. It just emailed me the scale ticket, too. That's way better than the old way. Yeah, so I'm just going to pull up here and park. I just pulled up the email that they sent me. It's a PDF file of the scale ticket. You can go inside and get the scale ticket if you want the printed version, but I mean, this is great. It's saying on the steer axle, got 7,540 pounds. Drive axle, 14,320 pounds. The trailer axle, which is gonna be the Jeep, this is 4,400 pounds, which I, was, I thought it'd be about 4,000. With a grand total, 26,260 pounds. Yeah, so we're a little lighter on the steer axle than I thought. Uh, the drive axle on this is rated at 15,500 pounds. So we're at 14.3. So yeah. you still got room to go there. And this has a combined weight rating of, I wanna say 33,000 pounds. Should uh, be pretty good then. Yeah, for $12, this is great. Yeah, that was fast. When you said use the app, I was like, oh, I don't know what that means, okay. Yeah, when I opened the app, it said, you know, TA, Perrysburg, Ohio, I-80, 90, X-71. Is this correct? And I said, yep, because it means uses GPS to locate you. And then I just followed the prompts, put in my information, and emailed me the ticket. Awesome. How are we doing on fuel mileage? According to the dash, 9.6. Not bad. Yeah. Uh, I was expecting single digits once we were all loaded down and heavy. Yeah. But I wanted to take a second. And everything is rides much quieter. You can still hear a little bit of squeaking, but that's just the padding that I put down. Yeah, there's there's still some rattles and stuff, but man, it is so much quieter than when we came home. Empty. Yeah. The microwave is shaking away. The no mattress. Plenty of space to walk through here. The dogs are sleeping, so. And the ride is very smooth compared to when it was empty. So, so far, I'm impressed. See Mike unhooking the Jeep. We're at our site. Getting ready to back in. Pretty uh, hop in place right now. There's people arriving all over. So, just taking our time, being patient. Of course, it's raining. We are all backed in. That is a giant beauty with a Jeep in front. Worked out pretty good. No issues. Mike backed it in like a like a boss, but it was raining, so I just stayed in. Never fails. Yeah. 2020 and it's raining. Sure is. At least, at least, it is not windy currently. So we can have the awning out and actually enjoy outside. I wouldn't expect it to not be raining. No. The chance is supposed to dwindle this evening around 6. And then tomorrow is supposed to be pretty decent. It's not going to be like sunny, but it's not supposed to rain. Well, it's so. almost 5 now. Yeah. See, somebody had a fire over there. It's just smoldering now. Yeah, that'll happen. Someone back behind us had one too, and same thing. It's a very uh, active park right now, which we expected. 
Dogs did great on the drive down. They got food in their bellies and they're ready to have a campfire. Oh wait, <laughs> that's probably not going to be happening, well, anytime soon, let's just say that. <laughs> it's, it's, like, 11, it's 11 o'clock at night. Hey, dog. Hey, listen, man. I ain't, listen, bro. I ain't hours. I was a day late this time, man, bro. <laughs> Mike, you gotta get better. You're gonna be kidding by his name. Mike, you, 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 you prayed for me, man. And, 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 and I don't know what. I thought, like, I think I know I'm better, Mike. What, what you think happened, Mike? <laughs> I, I don't know. We prayed for you. We did. Shit. I know you did. I feel better. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least, at least you made it. I made it, my brother, man. I'm glad you was woke. I said, Mike, if you sleep when I get here, I ain't gonna be to see the match in the night. <laughs> what up, bro, bro? It's noon, right on time. It's noon. Man, I'm horrible, man. I'm supposed to be at noon, man. And I got up earlier. I think she was being lazy this morning. I got to tell her to get up, man. She... Uh, we knew it would be Jackie's fault. I'll tell you. I talked to bro this morning. I tell you, bro, listen, man. I'll be there. In two hours, bro. It's six hours late. <laughs> it's like five thirty almost. But how the heck? You, how the heck are you five hours late? <laughs> you, when they get that long, you ain't late no more. You just, you just got there. <laughs> <laughs> Pick my Mike, Mike's brand a little bit more. Give me some of the, that free info, my man, man, Mike. <laughs> Mikey, Mike, Mike, I like it. I like it. I like the information you give me, man. I like that shit, though. I love. It. What's the name of your channel gonna be? Kicking with Kenny, baby. He's on his way. Kicking it with Kenny. Shit, coming to a TV real soon. Is Coach gonna put you in the game soon? Shit, Coach gonna put me in the game, baby. I'm in the game, Coach. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. First string, baby. First string. <laughs> Starting, baby. <laughs> I ain't sitting no bench. I'm going straight to the top. Yeah, you'll you'll surpass us. <laughs> it's my prediction. Walk number two is in the books, and so is the dog's dinner. They are ready for just chill time. But I think we're gonna take the top off and go cruise around a little bit. Pretty nice out right now. The sun decided to come out. We're going topless. Sunday night, beautiful weekend aside from Friday. And it's been sunny and in the 80s today. Big surprise. <laughs> no, it's been great. We uh, took the doors and top off the Jeep. 
yesterday and today we took the top down and I even got a lesson in driving stick shift. <laughs> so another lesson, it's my second lesson. How'd I do, Mike? You did great. Well, you're just too scared. Yeah, I'm nervous, so I need some uh, coaching, which coach here coach. got me through it. Yeah, thanks to Kenny, I'm <laughs> a coach now. Yeah, we're just sitting here enjoying this lovely fire, and you might be wondering, why are you in Pymatuming, Ohio? And not Wisconsin. And not Wisconsin. Well, I found out just a couple days ago that I had to stay in Ohio for work unless I wanted to use unless I wanted to use two weeks of my own paid vacation to self-quarantine from leaving the state. So I opted not to do that and just to stay in Ohio for now. Yeah, we're super bummed we didn't go to Wisconsin, but we'll get there. Yeah, soon we'll get there and it'll be probably even better weather a little later in the year, summer. Perfect.